Hi everyone, today I'm taking a look at a plugin that has become uh, one of my secret weapons for a quick and easy, great sounding acoustic guitar. If you're new to this channel and uh, you like the content I'm uh, doing, please do uh, subscribe and uh, comment and ask questions and uh, all that jazz and I'll uh, get back to you. Remember to click that bell so you get notified uh, whenever I post new uh, videos. And uh, starting next week I'll be doing uh, probably a couple of videos a week. Anyways, a plugin I've uh, started to use quite regularly um, in recent times on acoustic guitars is the CLA Unplugged, which is part of the CLA uh, signature series from uh, Waves. Normally I don't like uh, plugins like that uh, all that much, but uh, I found this works uh, really great for um, getting quickly a very good um, acoustic guitar sound. Very easy to use. Just a few sliders and, uh, and a couple of uh, options on uh, on each of those. As you can see in the picture of him, to the left you have a input slider. And above that you have um, knobs that you can uh, tweak the um, pre-delay on uh, the two reverbs that the plugin has. The main section of the plugin, you have a bass and treble control, each with three different um, frequency points. Next to the bass and treble controls, you have uh, two reverbs, which you can set to um, yeah, room, hall, canyon. <laughs> you basically tweak the, the length and the type of uh, reverb uh, there. And you also have a delay. Uh, and to the right, you have an output uh, slider where you can uh, balance the levels in and out of the plugin. Underneath there you have a button where you can uh, turn off the direct signal which is handy when you are tweaking the reverbs and uh, delay. I got some acoustic guitars going through a folder track in uh, Reaper. Before the CLA plugin I have a Fat Filter Pro Q3 where I basically uh, pull out some uh, ringing frequencies and, uh, and some high pass. Next up I have the CLA Unplugged uh, plugin. You'll now uh, hear me setting it up and uh, trying out some different settings on it and uh, hear what I eventually land on.
and to finish things off I have a compressor after the CLA plugin uh, this time the Klanghelm MJUC on the Mark II uh, setting sounding good and I'll now play you the guitars uh, together with the bass and drums on uh, on this song just so you can hear how it uh, fits in uh, in the mix Plugin. It's nothing there that you can't do with uh, other plugins uh, when you're doing mixing, but uh, I found this works great as a simple and easy way to uh, to get the acoustic guitars going. A tip here is uh, paying attention to the Waves uh, site as they often have uh, some really good deals on uh, plugins from time to time. Often you'll find uh, some plugins uh, that at about uh, 29 uh, bucks. Just check in there uh, every once in a while and you, you can get yourself a killer deal. Anyways, that's it for this time. Thanks for watching and uh, have a marvelous uh, weekend. <laughs>